You know, the New Yorker, uh, the caption cut is really interesting. It's really become part of uh, a popular culture. Here's this little clip from Bored to Death. What would a police doc say to a suicidal bear? You can bear it? Now, God, that's terrible. I'm never going to win this thing. What are you doing? Ah, uh, um... <laughs> so a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of people uh, are doing that. So really, so far we've had that many entries, this many winners, and, and that's your chance. <laughs> but like I said, like I said, you've got a, a lot better, a lot better chance, a lot better chance today. And you know, it may, you may have a better chance if you're, I don't know, from California. <laughs> so how many of you guys are from California? Oh, yeah, so like your ringers here. So you've won, we hate you, you've won 50, uh, 50 of the contests. New York is next, and I don't know where you, know, where you are. Uh, how many from Massachusetts? Yeah, you've been doing pretty good. You've been doing pretty good. And look, even Texas has won three. Okay. That, that Perry is a, is a funny guy. <laughs> Now, one of the questions is, will I be helped by entering mo frequently? Well, here are the most frequent enter entrants. They, they haven't won. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and I looked it up also. I'm really happy none of them are here. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're sort of bitter. Uh, oh, OK. So Roger Ebert wrote this. I've entered the New Yorker cartoon caption almost weekly, virtually since it began, and have never, ever been a finalist. Mark Twain advised, write without pay until somebody offers to pay you. If nobody offers within three years, sawing wood is what you're intended for. <laughs> I have done more writing for free for the New Yorker in the last five years than for anybody in the previous 40 years. <laughs> but after entering 107 contests, he won. It says he won with this one. I'm not going to say the word I'm thinking of. 